What's going on people? Mike C Town here. So I recently did a review of the new Kiro Kiro Benito album. And uh yeah, so let's 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 talk about this. It appears that some of the things that I said in the review have got a lot of you guys up in arms. So let's go through this a bit because most of the stuff I find to be either ludicrous, hilarious, or both. I call the album meme music. And uh, what I meant by meme music is shit that people don't take seriously. Shit that people like ironically. Like like mustaches or uh, dudes in white jeans or fanny packs. I seriously figured that people listen to this album as a joke because it's so stupid. So in turn, I didn't think that anyone would give a shit that I shit on it because I didn't think anyone was taking it seriously. And that's, you know, that's how I am with, with the Spice Girls. I would not give a dick if someone shit on the Spice Girls. Why? Because I don't take their artistry seriously. I don't care if someone hates them. I don't care if someone hates Katy Perry. I don't care if someone hates any of the music I listen to, to be honest, but especially the bubblegummy silly shit. And the fact that people take the artistry of Kiro Kiro Bonito seriously, it's ridiculous to me, but hey, it takes all types of people to make this world go round, uh, which leads me to my next point. I said that no one really liked this shit uh, and that everyone voted for it to troll me. And okay, this is the main one that I want to discuss because this is the main one that you guys are acting like complete titty babies over. Okay, so I honestly did not think that people were seriously into this album. Apparently, I was wrong. Apparently, a bunch of y'all ride around bumping this shit and that's fucking great. So I stand corrected. Am I gonna apologize for that? absolutely not that's not my fault for thinking that this was a joke and it's not really that big of a fucking deal the fact that you guys are so angry that i didn't think that people actually liked this kiro kiro bonito album is beyond hilarious to me this isn't me music i love this band i am genuinely offended by you saying that this isn't serious music think about this all right can you really blame me for not thinking people took this seriously. If I was wrong, okay, I was wrong, but I'm not gonna sit here and accept that I missed some grand artistic movement with this shit. Like seriously, give me a break. This isn't high art. You know, this isn't a David Bowie album. This isn't Sun Ra, all right? This isn't a fucking Frank Zappa album, okay? This is not a Kendrick project. If someone heard King Diamond with his high-pitched vocals, Grandma! and assumed it was a big joke, I sure as shit would not get all pissed off about it. Why? Because I totally get why they would think it's a joke. I'm not gonna assume that everyone knows the history of King Diamond so as to not think it's a joke, but the difference is there's a huge online catalog and history to go through with King Diamond. There's not a lot of info about Kiro Kiro Bonito, so I derived my opinion based on the information that was available. Fucking sue me. To the people who are mad that I thought y'all voted this album up to troll me again, can you really blame me? Like, are you fucking serious? Let's break this down just a bit, alright? Since I've been doing this Out of My Element segment, I've done Corey Feldman, I've done Little Yachty, I've done Young Thug, and I've done this. That's three artists that people have flat out said, let's upvote this because it'll be funny. Do you have any idea how many times I saw that comment? That's not saying that everyone upvoted it for that purpose. And that's not saying that no one likes Thugger or Yachty. Corey Feldman is a different story, but the other two, sure, they have an audience. But when people flat out say they're voting for these albums as a joke over and over and over again, then that sets a fucking precedent that this sentiment is going to continue. So you're blaming me for listening to a goofy faux J-pop album with rapping and assuming that you guys did it as a joke. Even though y'all have done it plenty of times before, this is my fault. Fuck that. Don't blame me for taking the word of a bunch of unknown YouTube handles. Blame the trolls for doing it. I don't know each and every one of you guys. So I'm basing my thoughts on this being a troll off of past experiences and off of what a lot of you have actually said. That's basic logic. If I was wrong, then I apologize to those of you who were actually serious. But don't act like I'm a dick for coming to conclusions.
So fine, I thought this was completely a troll and I was incorrect. Uh, I still believe that it was partly a troll, maybe even mostly a troll, but just not completely a troll. Fine, some of you guys take this shit seriously. Go figure. Fine, some of you who listen to this are not LARPers or cosplayers. And fucking Christ, y'all really got mad about that comment. You'd think that people who listen to goofy ass music like this would be able to take a fucking joke and not take themselves so seriously. For those of you that were mad that I didn't spend time breaking this album down and analyzing it, uh, yeah, give me a break. There's really nothing to break down here. Um, for those of you that said that I didn't get it, uh, again, give me a break. There's really nothing to get. This is simply you like it or you don't. Some of y'all did. I sure as shit don't. It's dope that some of y'all enjoyed this, but don't play with me. Like, this album is not deep. Stop it. For those of you that implied that I should have liked this because Fantano like this you are the absolute worst kind of music fan the type looking to have your opinions validated by somebody popular which is really fucking whack grow up if you like something then like it that's great uh but when it comes to to art consumption there is absolutely zero logic in saying that so and so like this so you must at least enjoy it the fact that people with this opinion still exist in today's day and age is just mind-blowing and for those of you that actually told me you were unsubbing because of my Kiro Kiro Benito review, um, all I can say to you is... <laughs> Seriously, if you must go, because I made fun of a Kiro Kiro Benito album, um, all I can say is, uh, see you later. I, I don't have any ill will towards you. I just give you... Uh, the deuces without prejudice. Um, I think it's silly, but I am absolutely not going to uh, cater my channel to people that get that upset <laughs> over a review of a J-pop album that they will call me names in the comment section and then put I'm unsubbing in all caps. Sorry. But okay, all of that said, uh, since you guys are telling me that this was supposed to be a real suggestion, then fine, I believe you, um, or at least I believe uh, a lot of you, so I take it back, I I'm not gonna kill this series, and I never really said I was gonna be done forever, I just said I wanted to rethink some of the things, because uh, I do still think there is a major troll problem with this series that needs to be cleaned up, but um, I'm gonna take y'all's word for it, uh, you weren't trying to troll me, fine. Um, so I'll let you know soon how the voting for the next album will happen. But until then, seriously, in the words of my boy Lil Yachty, man, chill. <laughs> it's not that fucking serious, guys. Um, yeah, as usual, thank you for loving, thank you for loving, thank you for being you. Please don't die, and I'll see you guys next time. All right, peace, bitches.